Hello everyone, today I will show you how to install a patch. A patch is a kind of software compatible with the system software. It is used to fix some urgent bugs in the system software. Patches are classified into cold patches and hot patches. A cold patch takes effect after the device restarts. A hot patch directly takes effect and does not require a system reboot. Cold patches are generally installed during upgrade process. For details, see the Device Upgrade course. You can log in to Huawei's technical support website to obtain patch files. In this course, I will use the hot patch S5720HI-V200R007 SPH002.PA as an example to describe how to install a hot patch and check the patch status. First, let's learn about the status of patches. A patch can be in deactive, active, or running state. A patch in deactive state is only loaded. A patch in active state is loaded but does not take effect. The patch automatically rolls back to deactive state and becomes invalid after the device or card restarts. A patch in running state takes effect. Before loading a patch, perform the following operations. Prepare the patch file. You can search for and download the patch file on Huawei's technical support website. Verify the software integrity. You can use the digital certificate verification method in the software package to verify the software digital certificate. Check the device's running version. Run the display version and display patch information commands to check the current system software version and patch version on the device respectively. Check the device's running status. The normal state indicates that the device runs properly. Back up important files in the storage medium, including the configuration file, system file, web system file, and patch file. Check the available space in the storage medium. To upload the target patch file to the device, ensure that the device has sufficient storage space to store the patch file. If the storage space is insufficient, delete unnecessary files. Exercise caution when deciding to delete a file. Now let's see the configuration roadmap for patch installation. Upload the patch file to the device, load the patch, activate the patch, run the patch, check whether the patch is successfully loaded. In this example, assume that the patch file has been uploaded to the device and has been checked against the patch loading checklist. The configuration procedure is as follows. Load the patch file, Activate the patch, run the patch, check whether the patch is in running state. Note that if the patch fails to be installed and the patch status is abnormal, you need to roll back the patch. The patch rollback procedure is simple. Delete the patch and then restart the device. I will not introduce how to roll back a patch in this course. I will demonstrate how to install a patch on a device. Load the patch file. Activate the patch. Run the patch. Check the status of the patch. We can see that the patch is in running state, indicating that the patch has been successfully installed. The entire patch installation process is complete. To obtain more information about common configurations and typical features of Huawei switches, see the All About Switches threads. How can we find these threads? We can enter, quote, All About Switches, unquote, site, colon, Huawei.com. In the search field of Google, and click any of the displayed links to enter Huawei Enterprise Support Community. For details about more features, visit the home page.
The All About Switches threads describe typical configurations and users' questions about Huawei switches. Okay, that's all about today's sharing. Thank you.